Anything that's really vibrant and colorful tends to have a lot of phytonutrients. Our goal really is to teach students how to create healthy, sustainable communities. We have a really awesome opportunity to have a garden on site and then be able to cook from the garden. There are recipes that we've been learning in here that are very nutritious and they're good for the body. You know, we have harvest of the month and other things that, you know, just help us. We cover everything from food safety and sanitation to very basic kitchen skills as to how to hold a knife, how to do simple cutting techniques. They love being able to grow their own food, cook their own food. They like to see how they can redesign their campus using technology like AutoCAD and Photoshop and SketchUp. They learn how to be landscape architects. I focus on the principles and elements of design that will allow the students to change and alter the environment around them. So this is our Pacer Quad project that, uh, that we're currently working on. There's this giant empty space and we want to do something about that. The reason why we're doing the mental mapping is to understand our campus more. Just like students in the past, who designed the promenade, we're designing the quad. We want to use permeable pavers, trees, lots of green stuff to make it very environmental friendly. It's pretty fun when you're in, involved in your school and you can make a difference in how other people think of your school. Make sure you guys are focusing up here, sketching. I expect them to come out knowing some of the principles and elements on how to affect the environment and how to redesign the environment and make it better than what it is. If they see a problem, they come up with solutions based on what they've learned in here.